Hey guys, welcome to The Fumble, I'm Crystal Marie. Matthew Della Vadova has found himself at the center of controversy, again. In Game 3 of the NBA Finals against the Golden State Warriors, Della Vadova found himself on a trajectory toward yet another opponent's legs when he and Draymond Green got tangled up in the first quarter. Green knocked Della Vadova away from the action with a screen, and the Cavaliers guard responded with a low blow. Take a look. This isn't the first time that Della Vadova's scrappiness has stuck out this postseason. In Game 3 of his Cavaliers Eastern Conference Finals tilt against the Atlanta Hawks, Della Vadova fell into Al Horford's knees, and Horford responded with an elbow to Delhi's head. That got Horford ejected after being assessed a flagrant two foul. Without their best player, the Hawks fell 114 to 111 in overtime. He scored. It's our ball. It's actually giving these guys. Oh, oh, did you see the elbow right there? Earlier in that series, Della Vadova injured star shooting guard Kyle Korver after sliding into the three point specialist's legs. Kyle Korver back to the, the locker room. In the Cavs' previous series, the second-year player from Australia drew a flagrant two on the Chicago Bulls' Taj Gibson when Delhi locked his legs around Gibson's ankle. You see the collision. Gibson went down. He felt he was pushed. And then with the kick on Della Vadova. Even Della Vadova's teammate, J.R. Smith, called the play dirty. The NBA eventually gave Della Vadova a technical foul for it. Della Vadova has turned into a valuable contributor and improved as a player from last season to this season. Perhaps that's why opposing teams are so quick to call him a dirty player. Do you think Matthew Della Vadova deserves to be called a dirty player? Comment below and let us know. To watch LeBron James and Matthew Della Vadova's hilarious handshake, click here. And before you go, don't forget to subscribe to The Fumble for the best highlights from all your favorite sporting events.